Hey cuties, Peachy here. Welcome back to a new video. And in this video, we have a bunch of Rainbow High news. So let's just get so into let's it. Start off with the new post by at ST Pixie Wings on Instagram. They took pictures of both Victoria and Kim. So here we have Victoria up first. And I think these are like the first pictures where it's like really like high quality pictures of Victoria. Uh, because you can really see the details of her face, the makeup, the freckles, um, and just these close-ups of her outfits. Like like the stitching, the embroidery, the little pearls, it just, it all looks so neat and like really, really dainty, really sweet. I, I really gotta say, uh, the, the two piece like really looks sweet on her. I like the color, I like the texture, the fabric feels like very nice and soft and the heels are a new mold. They're painted like uh, two different colors and then the base and then the straps and the, um, wouldn't it be really cool um, if they started painting the toenails as well? Like that. I just realized that could be so neat <laughs> but uh yeah i think you know it's victoria she's she i feel like every time i see a picture of her a new picture i'm like okay wow she she how does she keep looking better it's just like the freckles and i also feel like under different lighting she looks different you know it's weird i feel like she has a weird skin tone where it's like she could look more olive toned and then in a different in an in under a different lighting she could look more pale more like pink undertone so it's like kind of weird you know <laughs> but i think she looks really nice and uh her eyebrows are also a much longer uh than uh, i think the first pictures we saw the first pictures we saw she had really short eyebrows i feel like now they look a little more uh longer they're not as short as uh lila's eyebrows for sure so yeah i feel like she she looks great and then her phone here the phone look at that phone it's a beach it's a beach picture of her i don't know where it's taken from i'm pretty sure it's like a, a reference to pacific coast high uh because it looks like pacific coast so I, i'm pretty sure maybe like she used to go there or maybe she like lives there and in malibu and maybe she just enrolled in rainbow high or maybe she's like an exchange student from pacific coast oh you know what that could make sense because they're like sister schools um yeah that can make sense uh so maybe i don't know what's the story here I, I do feel like there has to be some kind of significance to her her picture here on the phone i mean like why else would they put it there uh i feel like there has to be some kind of you know reason but it's a cute phone the phone case the makeup uh, blah, blah, blah. you know i feel like she looks great she's cute and um I'm just really glad that you know she she looks really unique with all these freckles and then just also like the little blush on her knees and the elbows is really unique like i've never seen that on any doll period like maybe porcelain dolls but like they don't do this anymore like that's really attention to detail and then here we have kim and you know very similar to victoria i feel like every picture i just i feel like i like her more uh and uh her makeup is just really vibrant and it really does suck that you might you, you could get a kim with great bangs or you can you could get one with horrible bangs it really depends on how lucky you get if you order them online if you don't and i feel like obviously you have a better luck of choosing the one you want in store because so far the bangs have been a really like miss hit or miss situation like sometimes it looks fine like right here the bangs are sitting they're looking pretty good you know like they're pretty good um but then like in other situations like in the last video it looks kind of messed up so it really is like a cost twin <laughs> it's like a 50 50 um but yeah i think the little details here on her dress like on the side with the little rh embroidery that's something i didn't notice before like i like that i like that detail here but it is really just so simple and then uh so simple and then the earring also like really nice a phone case but again like i mentioned i feel like if she had gotten a necklace she really need she really needs a necklace she really needs something like on top uh, up top it's really bare to me at least i feel like it, she just needs desperately a necklace like instead of earrings i don't care like give her a necklace she needs something else you guys like accessorize accessorize girl. then here's something new thanks to at brats heaven on instagram uh, on their story for sharing this we actually get to see kim wearing her denim jacket so far we've only gotten to see her wear it across you know over her shoulders which i feel like is a really good look it's uh, definitely like I, I still feel like i would display her that way but but, you know she also looks pretty cool wearing her jacket and it's a really nice jacket it's very very bulky and uh here they have it closed but i imagine if you leave it open it will look completely different as well maybe like even baggier i like that i like a baggy look so maybe i'll um you know put it all over her shoulders or maybe like i'll make her wear it i don't know i feel like there's a good variation here uh but definitely feel like she still could have used like a bigger like a necklace or
wore maybe some tights, a sock, better shoes, um, just or a belt, just just one more accessory. Like one more accessory could have literally made uh, her whole outfit look much more, you know, cohesive. Next up here, things to add the dolly insider. We have uh, more pictures of Olivia that were found on a Facebook group. Apparently, I don't know the original source, so I'm very sorry. But uh, yeah, Facebook basically. So Olivia, we've already seen a full unboxing video of. But the thing here that I see is totally different is her little buns. They're a completely different shape here. They look more like a uh, unicorn like here than like little buns. Like they're much more longer. So that's also something you might have to look out for when you if you ordered her because if you order her you will not get to choose what kind of buns you will get with her hair. But if you go to get her uh, in person obviously you will probably get a whole variety of different hairstyles and finishes for her buns that just look different. So that's something that's also going to be a hit or, hit or miss, but I feel like other than her hairstyle may, may be varying, you know, differently. Um, the face up is beautiful, stunning, the eye color, the outfit, uh, and she looks really good next to the other Rainbow, Rainbow High girlies already. Um, just her color is so unique. I definitely love that for her. And uh, I know, yes, I saw Mila in the background. Yes, she has a huge forehead, but uh, you know what? We don't hate on big foreheads here it's just it's, it's just part of her she was born that way okay <laughs> no but um i don't think all milas have big foreheads like that it's just a matter of rooting sometimes in the factory just like sometimes it's just like a little bit further back you know <laughs> here we have a f actually our first unbox look at uh, michelle saint charles and she looks great i hear i don't know why it's in two pigtails and also why i'm not sure why she's on priscilla's doll stand this is obviously not her dolls and it's it's supposed to be orange this is more like pink like priscilla's so i'm not sure why but um yeah the hair still looks great again even if it's in pigtails for whatever reason <laughs> but the one thing here that i know this is her nails the nails are super long look at like i definitely feel like this is a new hand mold because um i don't think the storm twins nails were that long were they that long i don't think they were the, the her nails look even longer like so, they look so long maybe it's just like the a trick of the lighting or like just they're not actually that long they look so long like literally so long i i love it i love her and uh oh yeah also pictures of victoria once again and like i mentioned the, li the lighting i feel like really affects the way her skin tone looks because here it looks more like greenish undertone and before it was more like pinkish undertone a little bit so more or more maybe more like yellow i don't know but um she looks different so i feel like yeah michelle oh my gosh i can't wait to see how long her nails actually See, this are. is what I mean for Kim. This is by at Miss Marifil on Instagram. They filmed a review on their account. So check it out if you want to see a full video on these two girls. Michelle as well, by the way. But basically, they put Kim in these black tights. And that already makes her look 10 times better. And she's also wearing her jacket here instead of it being like over her shoulders. I feel like maybe she just looks better with the jacket on. I would maybe leave it open. I wouldn't close it um or maybe i would i don't know i still feel like she needs she needs she, she needs a necklace <laughs> i still feel like even with the tights a necklace silver necklace oh my gosh it would do her wonders um and then michelle apparently her belt is just a recolor of a existing belt piece that was used on the mc square um dolls that were uh, a netflix show and, and so uh, if you remember these yeah so that's a belt that actually came with her with this doll originally and they just recolored it and use it on a rainbow high doll. That's very sneaky, MGA. Wow, okay. Next up, we have more stock photos. In the previous video, we took a look at all the individual stock photos of the characters, and here we have a group shot. They look so cute together. Honestly, I like this series. It's pretty strong. And then here we have the individual Amazon listings uh, with the pricing of $26.99, and the release date is the 26th Oh wow, so they cost 26 and they will and they will be released on the 26th of this month. So that's pretty cool. So yeah, they they release on Amazon by the end of this month, meaning that by the beginning of March, um, I'm pretty sure they should be available in Target, Walmart, whatever, you know. So that's pretty great. That's a really swift release right after Shadow High Series 2 as well. I and I'm telling you, I probably I, I I'm pretty sure that after they release series five, or at least 
least like at the end of this month we will get uh maybe some kind of like release date for season four i'm pretty sure <laughs> and then we do have some new clips some new animated looks at monique and priscilla in this new tiktok that came out yesterday to celebrate valentine's day here's the clip now uh i'm not showing the volume the volume is muted because they do uh, play a copyrighted song but uh basically it's just a lot of dancing a lot of characters you know kaya makes it my kaya makes an appearance after she was like mia for like a season <laughs> um and that's the clip so yeah it starts off obviously um and i know it's a tiktok so it probably has no actual like place in the season four plot it's probably just like very random for a good reason um but it starts off with monique dancing in the rainbow high halls and i do think that's not a coincidence i think that's obviously done on purpose because in the season four i do think we will see more shadow high characters uh, work together with rainbow high characters and also it will take place project runway will take place in rainbow high um and that's why maybe she's at rainbow high in the holes dancing or whatever i am really glad that they included kaya though because i mean she is the valentine's day special edition doll uh unofficially but she was the special edition valentine's day doll that came out like very early in the release very early in rainbow high's uh you know first year like 2020 so uh yeah she was the valentine's day doll and uh she had she's been in like episodes but like in the background she hasn't had like a speaking role in so long um so that's very sad but yeah you know and then mara for whatever reason she's here she's pink i guess that's why they included her but then why is monique here she's not pink she's not you know <laughs> anyway i don't know <laughs> but then priscilla she shows up at the very end and we barely get to see her full outfit but we do and she looks great I, f I mean obviously we got to see her speak in that last clip like a while ago um but yeah she looks great and i'm very excited to see what happens in season four um i do i definitely feel like i said before i definitely feel like by the end of the this month we will get some kind of release date for season four i feel like it just it just makes sense you know season uh, series five rainbow high characters rainbow high dolls is coming out and then by the beginning of next month hopefully we'll have like maybe a first episode or just or just you know like the release dates of you know when it's going to come for sure because we haven't had any news you know we haven't had any official news you know we got that whole schedule leaked a while back uh and i made a video about that but it's not official so it could change so let's see when that happens uh, i do i have a good feeling though i feel like season four is going to drop very soon and then we'll finally get to see what this whole story is about and like what's gonna happen with sunny and luna and are we ever gonna find out why are shadow high characters so differently you know colored like their skin tones are so off and fantasy looking and by the way i'm actually gonna make a video all about that question and i'm gonna include your answers so i have a poll up right now on my instagram story if you want to check it out and give your own two cents about maybe why you think shadow high characters are grayscale or just have different skin tones uh, let me know and then maybe it'll shout out and then maybe it'll it'll probably show up in the video that i'm gonna make coming this week uh sorry i just wanted to let you know because um yeah i feel like i want to know every kind of opinion every kind of maybe idea that anyone has as to why they are different like they're grayscale or have different skin tones because it is a very fascinating question that they have not answered and i feel like they will not answer ever it's just they're not going to <laughs> but yeah i'm very excited and i cannot wait um for season four literally i can't i can't rainbow high uh season three rainbow vision was a hot mess so i'm like i'm just ready to move on you know let me know what you think of season four down below but yeah that was the video i hope y'all enjoyed leave a like share comment subscribe hit the notification bell if you haven't already so you don't miss out when i post more content like this coming your way daily and keeping you up to date with all the dolty you love stay safe be kind i hope this next time stay peachy kisses Thank you.